Let us talk about what a one-to-one -one and onto function. Well, a function is one-to-one -one if no two values, if no two values of x will produce same y. will produce same y. Mathematically, how could you write this? That is fx1 is not equal to fx2 whenever x1 is not equal to x2. Hmm. So this is a one-to-one -one function. Now, no two values of x will produce the same y. Now, in your function, y is equal to x square. You had this function. When x is equal to minus 2, y is equal to 4. When x is equal to plus 2, y is still equal to 4. So two values of x are producing the same value of, of y. Even though it is a function, but it is not one-to-one -one function. It is not one-to-one -one function. Okay, well, you can see this diagrammatically as well. You had this kind of the graph. Okay, so, and this is y is equal to x square. Hmm. So, two values of y, say for example, let me just put it like this, yeah, this is a higher size, yeah, okay, so this is a given value of y. Now, the same value of y is produced for two values of x here, you getting the point? So. So there are, there are two values of x. One is x1 and other is x2. Both of them are producing the same value of y. Okay. This coordinate is basically x1, y. And this coordinate is basically x2, y. So two values of x are producing same value of y. Um, what about in case if you pick up... Uh, if you pick up a line, something like this. Hmm. Well, if you pick up a line, say y is equal to 2x plus 3. Hmm. You have y is equal to 2x plus 3. Let us just plot it first of all. How do you get this? Let me just have a better one. Yeah, y is equal to 2x plus 3. So x and y, when x is equal to 0, y is equal to 3. And when y is equal to 0, x is equal to minus 3 by 2. Okay, so x is equal to minus 3 by 2 or minus 0 0.5, something like that. So when x is equal to 0, y is equal to 3 this point and when y is equal to 0 x is equal to say minus 1.5 here so this is 3 this is say minus 1.5 here and if we want to put it using a graph something like this. Hmm? So, well, this graph is drawn in R2 and uh, it goes up like this. Y is equal to 2x plus 3. So, for all the values of x which you have, you have just one value of y. Huh? As you could see here, let me just give you some more examples here. Uh, 
for any value of x, say when x is this, x is this, y is this. When x is this, y is this. So for any value of x, you have a different value of y. Okay, no two values of x will give you the same value of y. So this becomes the one-to-one -one function. Now, what are onto functions, basically? So onto functions would be, onto functions are a function f from a to b is called an onto function if for all b belonging to b there is ex there exist a belonging to a such that f of a is equal to b that is all elements all elements in b are used all elements in b are used say for example you have uh, you have say two sets a and B, hmm, that is A and this is B, and you have different, uh, you have different elements here, say it is R, S, O, and you have different elements here, okay, so both So all the elements in B they are used. Hmm. So A on to B. In case if I have something like uh, there is one more element here which is not used, so then you will say that this doesn't become an onto function. You get the point? I'll give you one more example here. Um, say the same example which you have y is equal to x square. Huh? y is equal to x square the same example which you have uh, I could actually just copy it down here I'm so sorry you let me just copy it down I don't know what I'm doing I should be doing this but I'm just trying to copy I don't know okay oh I'm so sorry yeah so you have this um, you have this. Now, tell me one thing. In case if you have a function which is moving from R to R, this is the function. So your domain is R and your range is also R. Um, you can actually use all the values of X here. Okay. But are all the possible values of Y used? Are all the possible values of y used? Maybe not. Say so because in case if it is r to r, then um, you are actually not using all possible values of y. So not all possible values of y are used. Okay, so this is not an onto function. Okay, let me give you one more example here. When, say, y, y is equal to mod of x minus 4. Hmm? y is equal to mod of x minus 4. So this function, 
this function would be 0 when x is equal to 4. When x is equal to 0, y would be equal to 4 and so on. Okay, and this will have this kind of the line here. Okay, so and one more line going going on like this. Hmm? So this is the function which you have. Clear? This is the function which you have. But you think about it, no values which are less than zero okay, on y-axis are ever used. So again, this function is not on to. You have the function which is going from r to r. This function was say r to r. But are you using all of these values of y? You're not using those values of y. So it means that this is not an onto function. Okay. But supposedly in case if you, if you change, if you change the function to say f dash going from r to only positive, uh, range, which is r to 0 to infinity, then this will become an onto function. Otherwise, it won't. 